as a leader, I think he would admit, I think the team would admit that he has some growth to do. They want to see that growth. It comes with the expectation of signing a contract as robust as he did. And I think he will welcome it this year. I think he will take the necessary steps to get better in areas where he needs to be better. In-game communication, you know, week to week, really emphasizing Monday through Saturday, which is what's been in the news each of the past two or three days with this addendum in his contract. But uh, I think Kyler Murray, we have to remember, is only 25 years old. He has a little bit of a baseball player mentality, a little bit of an introvert. Not everybody can be Russell Wilson. And I think where he gets comped is to Russell because he's the closest thing, but they're two completely different people. I had the opportunity to cover Russell as a part of the NFC West. and He's just a unique individual. And Kyler can gravitas the locker room and his teammates by just being Kyler. And they know having him under contract each and every Sunday, they drive to the stadium. They're on the road. They have an opportunity to win. And I've seen a lot of guys play quarterback for the Cardinals that have immense leadership qualities that don't have the talent or the skill set. So uh, Michael Bidwell, president, owner, Steve Kime, the GM, and, of course, Cliff Kingsbury, they're banking on Kyler, being around guys like the aforementioned J.J. Watt, being around the James Connors of the world, DeAndre Hopkins, and that leadership maturation process grows in time. 